Hi everyone! We're gonna do abs, abs, and lots of abs today. So it's gonna be lots of fun. You'll feel your abdominals working, and let's get started. Okay, let's get started. Starting session. So first one, we're gonna do twisters. Try to keep the heels, toes together. You're gonna lock the hands together. Elbows go one way, hips go the other. 50 seconds. So if you don't wanna do it with the hopping, you can just do a little heel lift, otherwise pull. Warming up the midsection, the hips, the feet, the shoulders, keeping it going. Prepping our abs. Keep the chest lifted, shoulders down. A little bit longer, 15 seconds. Squeeze the knees together. Almost. Okay, so come on down. These are called half get-ups. So Take the feet wide, press the heels into the floor, one arm out, you're gonna reach up and then down. Exhaling. So the arm helps a bit, but you wanna initiate from your core. Anchor the heels down. Lock the elbow of the arm that's reaching. Taking it up. Make sure you add a little twist, a little reach across too. Okay, great, we'll do that on the other side. Coming back down. You can always bend the knees a little bit. If it helps to anchor the legs here. Reaching, reach out, and down. Great. Strong exhale to lift yourself up. Inhale, down. That's good. Keep it again. Gently hugging belly to the back the whole time. A little bit longer, a few seconds. Perfect, all right. So let's uh, come on to all fours. We're gonna do little crawls. So tuck the toes under or flat feet, cover the knees, and then you're gonna reach opposite arm leg, but stay low, come back. So it's harder if you flatten out the feet, Inhale back. So you want those knees pretty much under the hips. Return back. Drawing the belly away from the floor. Elbow stays soft. Keep it going. Use that breath. Inhale back, wide into the ribs. Okay, perfect. So come on to your back. This time cross right ankle over. Left arm reaches up, right arm supports. We're gonna reach across like this. So glue your heels together. Nothing's really happening in the lower body. Keep the hips anchored down. Again, working those obliques, but also hip stability. Great. A 
Really reach, anchor down as you lift the upper body. Keeping it going. Always check back with your abs that the belly's not popping out as you reach up. Keep it anchored. Okay, good. So we'll switch sides. So now we'll cross left ankle over right. Left arm behind, right arm reaches, lock that elbow. Reach through the fingertips, lift through the shoulders, rotate through the core. Great. So you may find one side's harder. This one's harder for me. You may just want to do both sets on that weaker side or less strong side. Because you want to balance out the muscles to have the full function of all the uh, muscles in the body. Press it up and down. Reach it a little bit longer, a few seconds. Okay, perfect. So let's, um, we're going to do a little hop side to side. So you're going to start in your plank position here, and then you're going to hop it like so. If you can't do that, just step foot side to side. All right, let's do this. Always come through the nice plank position as you return center. So again, we got the obliques working. A lot of shoulder work too. Keeping it going. Quite the challenge. 10 seconds. Perfect. Okay, come onto your back again. These are called X crunches. So you start wide arms and legs and then you're going to reach everything up. So here and down. And then spread the arms and leg wide. Good. And wide here. Strong exhale to come up. So they're very hard. So you can always do if you just want to do one side or cross it, you can do it like this as well. So see what works for your body. Almost done. Great, okay. So come onto your side. Lots of obliques, we're gonna do a jackknife move. So you can do this, like that, or arm leg, chop it. Long stretch at the end, exhale to come up. Good, maybe reach up a little higher, and down, and down. Keep it going, gaining strength. Fifteen seconds. Almost. Oops, and one. Okay. Great, so we'll switch sides, same thing. So feel free, you can always just bend, elbow and knee, otherwise extend out and reach. Good. Great. You can keep going, not much longer. It's a short workout. It's a hard one, but it's short. It'll be over soon. Squeeze down. There you go. Right. A little bit longer.
longer here. Woo. Okay, great. So we're now going to do, come onto your back, uh, a little bit of a, a bicycle crunch. We know these ones. So you're going to point. Ground that belly into the floor. Keep it going. Almost. One more. So come into the side plank again. You could just hold your side plank, knees or toes, or you're gonna add a little bit of a reach around and reaching up. So if you're doing the arm reaching around, lift your ribs like so, and then open. And around. Got one more side to go, and then we're done for today. Fantastic, other side, last bit. You're less than a minute away from this workout being done. Okay, so push it up, reach, and through. Trying to lift the hips a little bit more as the arm scoops in and around. Good. Ten seconds. Home stretch. Perfect. Well done. Thanks again for joining me, and I hope to see you next week.